Hi, this video is going to be on a beam presentation. So basically the display types of your beam. So if I click on this, you can see the system line here is a little longer than this beam, right? So it's like, right, so it has something, it has some sort of feature to it. So if we go down to display type and click on features, you can see that this feature is the cut. So we can double click on that and it'll tell us it's two inch cut from a reference line. And the reference line is the end of the beam because I put the UCS at the end of the beam. And it is this feature here. So basically, if you click on this beam, you can go to display type and you can do exact with edges. So you can see exactly what the beam looks like. But it's not good to do this really because it slows down the performance of your computer. So most of the time you're going to want it on standard unless you're creating a custom connection or something like that and you want to see your features. You could just click feature. Now you can just see the feature. And over here, you can click with edges. So it does other ones. Symbol is just in the middle. Exact. I'm not quite sure what exact does, to be quite honest with you. It's not showing me the system line anymore. And it doesn't show me the edge features. So it's not something that I use. So this one I use. Or if I just want the feature. Or this is standard. So basically, you could do the same thing over here on the palette. If you go down here to this Quick Views palette, you can click on this beam and click here, and it will cycle through the different feature types. So also, if you have your features turned on, you can just select all these and click this, and it'll put it back to the basic. It should put it back to the basic one. So... Obviously, sometimes that doesn't work. Standard presentation is what it should have went to. Or you can pick them all again. And you can cycle through it again. And what we'll do is we'll go back to the symbol. And let's see if standard presentation works this time. So it worked that time. Alright. I hope that helps. Take care.